But remember, be disciplined. When you're disciplined and you sleep on time, you set your clock, you turn off your phone if need be. And what happens? You then turn it on in the morning or you make sure that you are sleeping at a certain time. Allah will grant you an automatic awakening from your sleep at a time when you are supposed to be up. That's the way the body has been tuned and made where when you get it used to something, that's it. And then you become productive because early morning you are fresh and ready to, to take up whatever challenges you have to take up for that particular day. But if you slept very late, you're going to get up very lazy. You may not even get up. You may miss your prayer. So you're distant from Allah. And then you get closer to shaitan. And what happens? Your day does not go well. You're, you're either yawning while you're at work or you, you cannot concentrate. Everything is connected. Your food doesn't digest properly. And so much uh, more happens that is negative. And you would find maybe you might want to sleep after Fajr. And although it's not prohibited to sleep after Fajr if need be, but you need to discipline yourself and make sure that the timings are right. Obviously, the reason I say this is people live in different time zones and in some countries, winter and summer, it becomes very difficult. But all that in its place, we need to make sure we fulfill our duties and obligations unto Allah and follow the method of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Similarly, ask Allah Almighty to help you to fight laziness. Allahumma inni a'udhu bika min al-jubni wal-bukhli and so on. The Prophet, peace be upon him, made dua against miserliness and cowardice and against laziness and against so many other things. Al-kasal. Kasal is laziness. Oh Allah, help me to overcome my laziness. And that was a dua of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. He didn't need it. He was the least from all of us in terms of, in fact, he was the best, the least in terms of weakness because he had none, but the best in terms of goodness and strength. So if he didn't need it, what about us? He used to pray in that particular way. He used to supplicate to Allah, Oh Allah, grant me this, grant me this, protect me from this and protect me from that. Subhanallah. Let's learn from this. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Dinjon and Dinjon Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Dinjon and Dinjon Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Dinjon and Dinjon Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Islamic Motivation, Dinjon and Dinjon Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you.